All right, everybody, what is going on? We're hopping into stage eight of the Supreme Magnificent Battle here against Beast Gohan, and we're hopping in with the Extreme Class Mission. Now, I'm going to give this one shot here with Super Bosses. Um, we're bringing STR hit for our STR unit. As you guys know, Extreme STR right now is just bad. Um, until we get Cell Max in the game, we have pretty much zero good Extreme STR units in the game. So I'm going to try. I'm going to try. I'm going to try this guy. If we lose here, I will switch to a Majin Power team. Uh, because I think Majin Power can get it done with either the um, Transforming STR Boo or the Fat Boo. The uh, STR EZA Fat Boo that uh, does the AoE. I, I think I can get it done with him. So if this dies, we're going to switch over. So we'll see. We'll see how, we'll see how easy this goes. Um, we're going to start out. This Gohan doesn't hit very hard, so I'm going to be greedy. I'm going to get Goku Black some hits in. Goku Black needs to get hit several times in his passive to fully build up. So that's, I'm just going to be a little bit greedy right here. We're going to get those hits in early uh, because we are going to need them. We need everybody on this team on their absolute maximum A game in order to get this mission done. So this Gohan Beast does not play around uh, very easily. He could lock somebody like this Goku Black in slot one. And we could just lose. I mean, because we don't have any like you know, uh, attack redirects, like we don't have the attack all thing, where all the attacks get redirected to one of the characters, we don't have that on the team, uh, we don't have like a revive, um, the only thing we really have is Broly's Domain, and that, that's about it, I guess we have Fusion Zamasu's as well, potentially, if it comes down to it, I may have to prioritize Fusion Zamasu's Domain over Broly's, um, Fusion Zamasu's gonna be good for these first two phases, um, especially the second phase where he's going to have type advantage. But in that third phase, it's going to be a little bit spooky for him. So we're, we're going to want to go fast through this event right here. Uh, by the way, if you notice, I don't have intros on right here. Uh, that is because we don't have time for this. We don't have time for entrance animations, unfortunately. So, all right, that's fine. Yep, that's good. Okay. Um, let's see what we get with orbs right here. Can we get seven? We can. Okay, so let's go ahead and do... Actually, hang on. I'm gonna, I want to get Zamasu built up a little bit here. Uh, it's just damage, but it, I think it's going to be important later on. So let's go ahead and grab that key right there. Uh, and then for Broly, we can just give him, like, whatever. It doesn't matter. Let's just give those. Okay. Um, but yeah, I, I think later on, we may need Zamasu's damage in order to win. So let's go ahead and just get that built up now. Um, it's no risk to put him in slot one either. Like, the, there's no downside to it. I think he and Broly, Chi, Lai, and Limo could make a decent rotation. Um, as you guys know, Zamasu does lose damage reduction on each appearance that he's on. So he starts out with 80, his next appearance he has 60, and then he goes down to 40, which is where he remains. So if I can put him slot 2 next to Broly, Chi, Lai, and Limo, on their 24 key super attack, they do give 10% damage reduction. So, you know, that'll boost Fusion Zamasu back up to 50%. Um... At which point, you know, he's at a little bit better, you know, defensively. Uh, th their damage reduction support really does help characters that already have a lot of built-in damage reduction like that. Uh, just because, you know, it's going to boost it back up. And, you know, it may not seem like a lot, but whenever these bosses are supering for, like, 3 million damage, you know, that's like an extra 300,000 damage off of, like, what they're doing, right? Because 10% of 3 million is 300,000, so that's like an additional 300,000 damage that you're peeling off of these attacks. So, it, it can matter. Um, and especially once it's coupled with, you know, and it, like 40% that's already existing, it's like, you know, now you're just cutting that down in half to like 1.5, which is a lot more manageable. Um, so we'll see. Plus they have big bad bosses. So these two make a really good rotation next to each other. They can just get big, big bad bosses all up in each other's grill. Uh, this is a little bit unfortunate because we have STR hit going up against the AGL phase right here. That kind of sucks. <laughs> of course, of course, of course, of course. Okay, we're going to do this. This really sucks. Um, let's grab those. STR hit. I mean, STR hit could die to one normal right here. I would not be surprised. He's getting support. He's going to get a stack in, but... I don't know. We'll see. Solid chance he gets blown away. Uh, unfortunately, I would really love to bring, like, Kefla. But Kefla is a super class unit. Kefla does not, uh, does not help with this mission. I could swap him out for maybe, like, Cooler. I could try to run, like, LR Cooler on here because he is on Broly's leader skill. I don't know. I don't know. I could have run Fat Boo. I could have brought him on the team, I guess. He's on Transformation Boost, right? Broly does lead Transformation Boost. So I, I, I guess I could have brought Fat Boo instead. But Fat Boo kind of needs to be on the Majin Power Team to get, like, his extra damage reduction that he gets. So I don't know. Um, we'll see. Hopefully that one attack in the middle is not a super. I mean, we'll see. 
We just need to hit to survive this attack. If he just survives, that's all I need. Well, I've liked a little bit less than 300k, but, you know, it is what it is. All right, he nullifies that. Double digits, double digits. Please don't super. Okay. This is going to hurt. How much does this do? One million. Let's get Majin Power Team. Okay, so here we are with the Majin Power Team. This is going to be a pretty solid setup right here. Um, notice how I do have the EZA, Bobbity, and Deborah on the team. That's just because there's not really any good, like, actual extreme AGL uh, Majin Power units. There is the Super Boo, but... Uh, <laughs> I'm not... I'm not, like, dying to bring Super Boo in here. I don't, I don't know about you guys, so... Let's go ahead and grab those orbs right there. We should be fine. This is basically the same setup that I used to win my... Um, artificial life form team. Like, like, this is basically the same setup that I use. A little bit different, um, because this time we are bringing Bobbity and Deborah, and we're bringing the STR Fat Boo. Um, in their places, I had the Dodging Boo, the, the skinny Boo that was on, like, the, the banner unit on Boo's banner. And who's the other unit that I had? It wasn't STR Super Boo. Who was it? Who was the other unit that I had on here from uh, Artificial Life Forms? Uh, dude, I'm drawing like the biggest blank right now. I mean, I could just go and look. I could pull up my video. Uh, who was it? Holy crap! My my brain is dying. Uh, cards. Let me go to the category and see if I can figure out who I brought. What in the world? My brain is actually just degrading. That was like a day ago. Granted, I keep recording all these videos at like midnight, so. Like, my, my brain actually is probably degrading. That is probably a true statement. All right, so yeah, we had... Yeah, Fat Boo. Oh, Mr. Boo! How could I forget... Oh, my God. I forgot Mr. Boo. My bad, guys. How could I forget Mr. Boo? Uh, speaking of Boo, let's go ahead and let Kid Boo get built up. Could be a little bit risky running him in slot one like this, but I want to get his hits in. I, I, I want to get his hits in. As long as we don't get one shot with the Majin Power Team, like, we're not going to die. That's the nice thing about the Majin Power Team. It's like, you have to get one shot to lose. Um, otherwise, you just keep surviving. So I can do risky things, like throw Kid Boo in slot one like this, and let him get a lot of his hits in that he needs to build up, so. Cool, cool, cool. Um, things are going well here. Um, of course, it's the Majin Power Team. The Majin Power Team's, like, actually the only relevant villain team in terms of, like, having, like, a wide roster spread. Like, Super Bosses is pretty solid right now on Global, but it's, like, six units. Like, like that's it. Whereas, you know, Majin Power's got, like, 10, like, 10-ish units that you can use. Um, so, you know, like, 10's better than 6, I guess. You know, like, villains are just in a really bad spot always in Dokkan. If you guys are unaware, like, a lot of the issues with villains is they're hyper-specific to their teams. It's like these Majin Power units right here pretty much all need to be run together. And so, as, you know, pieces of these teams start to age out, it just because I don't want to say impossible to run these teams, but it just like it, it's not easy. It's not easy. Um, let's go ahead and get some stacks in for Fat Boo. Um, Boo tanks. I mean, he could definitely use the stacks, but let's just let's just get Fat Boos in. Um, so let's 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 do that. All right. Uh, this will do a little bit of damage to us, but we're guarding, so it's it's not going to be detrimental to us. Again, we'll just heal all of this back off. The nice thing about Majin Power, again, I, I've said it, but. You don't die, you live. That's it. But, I mean, that's true of, like, everything, right? Like, you live if you don't die, but you guys, you guys know what I mean. All right, listen. Don't criticize me. All right, I, I see you typing. Backspace that comment right now. Um, okay, so what do we got going on here? I guess we can just keep Kid Boo in slot two like this. That's fine. I'm not really concerned about him. If he just wants to be a mainstay rotation unit, totally cool with that. Um, this Bobbity and Deborah, remember that they do support um, Majin Power category allies, so everybody's getting a little bit of support right here. Except for them. They're not on Majin Power, but um, they are, so that's good. Uh, the Majin Power cate or category being strictly like, you know, like the Boo characters and people with Boo attributes like Android 21 and Majub. Pretty good. All right, um, the nice thing, too, like, it, it may not actually seem like a nice thing, but go on nullifying these super attacks that we're doing is actually good for us because it means we can stall out in this phase a little bit and we can stack up our stacking characters. 
Um, so that that's actually kind of a benefit for us as opposed to like a detriment. I would rather just kind of chill out in this AGL phase because there's not really anything he can do to like wipe us off the field. Like, yeah, like you see, like we're, we're fine in this AGL phase. So if we just want to hang out here for a little bit, stack up all of our stacking characters, that way we're ready to go once we get to Beast. Totally cool with that. That is that is in the playbook. I do not need to go fast through this phase at all, other than I kind of want to go to sleep. And I still have like four thumbnails to make for the videos that I'm putting up tomorrow. So, you know, I, I would like to go to sleep. But at the same time, I want to get videos out for you guys because I want you, want you guys to enjoy what I'm doing up here. So, um, yeah, we can just do this. Uh, I'll throw a boo tanks in slot one. Let's just try to save all of these. Well, can I? I'll, let me do this. I'll, I'll put fat boo in slot one. That way we can get I need to get boo tanks a stack. That's very important. Uh, and then we can give all of these STR orbs to fat boo right here. That, that'll be good. Um, he needs those. He needs those. I'm not too concerned about all those attacks at the end. He's got some damage reduction. We just gave him 11 orbs, which is a lot. Um, we'll see. I'm not I'm not too concerned here. Uh, preferably, I'd like the super attack to be on one of the first two slots. That would be good. Probably going to be in slot three. I don't know if Fat Boo could eat the super attack. This would be his scariest phase, the, the SDR Fat Boo, obviously, because he's type disadvantage. Um... So, I, I, I would like to see how he tanks here. I'm not really worried about normals. I think he's good on normals. It's just, uh, I, I don't know how he's going to do on super attacks. Again, we got 11 orbs. Um, he is a nuker, so we'll see. We'll see. All right, 9.2 million. Not too bad. Not too bad. We'll take it. All right, let's see how we do here. Uh-huh. Yep, did a little critty do. Critty do. Uh, we got a double super. That's good. I think he gets defense on super attack effects, so that's, that's good. Um, nice double super there. Okay, double digits, double digits. Here's the super attack. Okay, no dodge. I should, probably should have made this guy full dodge. I don't think he has like any equipments on him. If I'm being completely honest, let's see how we do here. That's not too bad. Like I said, um, I mean that's like the, like that was the super attack that was going to do the most damage to him. And I mean, look, we're already back up to like full HP. So, um, that's that's pretty good. <laughs> Let's throw a fat boo in slot one. I don't know that we're guarding here, though. So, actually, let's put the skinny boo in slot one. Um, I, I don't really want to revive yet. I want to try to save the revive for beast. That would be the ideal thing to do. And, yeah, again, look, we're back up to full HP. I mean, that's the thing. Like, type disadvantage. Like, that was the scariest thing for him. He ate it. We survived. And now we're back at full HP. Like, like that's... I love the Majin Power team for that. It's like, if you do not die, you survive. It's... Step one, step two. You don't die. Here we go. You keep going. I love it. I love it. I love it. Like, no other team has the recovery power of this team. This team just... It's got so much recovery potential. Which I really like. Like, it's just so much fun. I, I wish we would get, like, a really good cell team like this. If they could just build up, like, a like a cell, a cell team that worked as effectively as this, that would be really, really cool. Um... Like, just kind of have that same effect of like, oh, you didn't kill Cell, here he comes again. No, here he comes again. Here, like, that, that, that's, I love that, I love that. We need a region category. If, if we could ever get a region category in Dokkan, that'd be, that'd be super tasty. Um, yeah, we're just, let's just keep stacking up here. No reason not to, just keep getting stacks in. We can just hang out in this phase all day. We can just keep stacking and stacking and stacking and stacking. Let's grab those. We don't need to get, like, a bunch of key with them. Here we go. All right, sweet. Uh, again, we're guarding. Uh, Boo Tanks is stacking. At, at any point, I could go ahead and switch into Boo Tanks' damage mode by going into Boo Han. Uh, after you transform into Boo Han, that's, that's where this man really starts laying wood. All right, like pipe. Pipe comes out whenever you transform into Boo Han. So at, at any moment, I could do that. It probably should at some point, but I'm just not really too concerned. Um, I, I think he's at, like, a pretty solid defensive level. He's still got some dodge. He's got, like, what, like, a high chance to guard? 70% chance to guard? And if we're guarding, like, like, the supers can't do anything to us. Let's see. Oh, man, we dodge it. Yeah, see, like, you see what I mean? Like, I'm not, I'm not too worried. Plus, we were guarding right there. So, like, eh, I wasn't, I wasn't concerned. You guys were worried. I wasn't. Boo Tanks has not let me down. That, that man has not let me down at all. That is such a good unit. Okay, they're letting me down a little bit. I need I need a dodge there, but that's okay. Again, if you don't die, watch this. Hey, look at that. Look at all that HP right there. 
Um, I... Is it extra? Is it worth it for that little bit of extra healing? No, it's not. Okay. Um, I, I like to keep this boo, by the way, the gray boo. I like to keep him in this form. Um, just because he's more defensive in this form. He's got the dodge chance, so... Alright, sweet. Fat Boo's not getting supered, and we're back up to full HP. I like, you know, it's pretty good. It's pretty good. I like it. I like it. I, I like this team. Woo! I'm running out of things to talk about here. Um, UI Goku coming out on... We don't know. Tech UI Goku, I mean. He just got announced. We got the producer's info tonight. And, uh, we discovered that he is going to be releasing soon, so that's good. Um, part of the ninth anniversary. Well, they're not calling him part of the ninth anniversary. He is releasing in his own celebration happening simultaneously with the ninth anniversary. So it seems like they're going to just shove Tanabata into the month of August, which is insane to me. But uh, they're going to do it. So cool, I guess. Don't know why we couldn't have gotten more content in like May and June, whenever it was pretty dry on Global and not much was going on. Figure, figure we could have shove some stuff in there if we're gonna shove stuff in places but uh you know they don't they don't pay me to make decisions they just i pay them to play their games so uh, you know who's the fool who's the fool here it's me it's me in case you guys were wondering it's it's me it's me all right cool all right we are just chugging along here everything is fine everything is good fat boo's gonna get some super attacks off mm -hmm. just block them all gohan that's fine yeah, you just smack those all out of the way, buddy. Yep. Guess what? I'm gonna dodge you too. Rat bastard. Alright, Boo Tanks is still getting some stacks in. This is good. This is good. It, it, like, getting attack stats in, attack stacks in with this guy is gonna make him, like, we're gonna, hopefully we're gonna get through this Beast Gohan phase fast. Um, that, that would be my ideal scenario, is we just get to Beast Gohan and we eradicate him, like, instantly. That'd be really good. Um, Unfortunately, we've just been like stacking in this phase for like 10 years, so that's that's kind of lame like this isn't really good footage um, <laughs> You know like uh, maybe you guys are enjoying this, but uh, You know Like it's kind of lame, right? Like it's kind of boring looks like we're gonna have to burn the Dokkan attack by the way, which kind of sucks but That is what it is um, Let's do fat boo first fat boo. He's gonna get the Dokkan attack. I guess but it's not really gonna matter um because he's like he's gonna do zero damage, so it is what it is. Like I, I don't even need to click the nodes, right? Because it, it's just gonna he's gonna block it. So I'm not I'm not even gonna click it. It doesn't matter. We're already at full HP too, so like we don't need the healing. Uh, again, like it, we don't need to watch that animation because he's just gonna. Oh, it actually goes through. I didn't realize that the Dokkan attack nullified. Huh? Because like you would still get. Huh? Yeah, well, that's interesting. Okay. Well, that's actually fine. Th that's fine that we didn't KO him right there because it means that we got an extra stack in. So that's cool. This is double digits, by the way. This is this is easy. Um, and then Skinny Boo also. He has like a four turn, I think, defense raise. So that that's good that we're keeping that stack up. Um, that'll raise his starter turn stats a little bit more. So that's good. All right, sweet. All right, into here we go. Who do we have in slot one? It is Fat Boo. I think it's STR Fat Boo. Please don't lock him. You can lock anybody else. All right, that's good. That's good. Uh, I think what I'm going to do is do this, and let's go ahead and transform. Should transform with Buhan. I think we should transform with Buhan. I think it's time. Uh, I'm not gonna play the animation. We've watched it a bunch this anniversary. Sorry, 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 sorry. It's like I just want to get this mission done. All right, so we're at a million defense with guard. Um, obviously, we'll need to just dodge the super attack, and we'll be fine. But we do, you know, easier said than done, right? You gotta, you gotta actually dodge the super attack before you can dodge the super attack. So let's do that. Okay. Um, oh, we didn't get a super attack with Fat Boo. That sucks. Um, okay, that's fine. That's fine. Dodge this, please. Thank you. All right, we're done. We're good. We're good. 11 million attack stat. Very nice. Very nice from Buhan. Uh, his damage will go up even more next turn, by the way. Because he does get some, like, stacks here and stuff. So that's good. Um... Fat Boo at the end, he might take some damage. I don't know. We didn't get enough key orbs with him. We do have type advantage, but I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. Uh, I do need crits, Buhan, by the way, buddy. Pal. Chum. Do, do need crits, man. You are Mr. Damage on this team. I, I need you to come through, buddy, please. Uh, Fat Boo can do some damage, but he's not Mr. Damage. Buhan's going to be Mr. Damage. Him and Kid Boo. Kid Boo can do some real damage as well. 
Um, just because he's like, I mean, Kid Buu just opens up with like a 20 million attack stat, right? Plus he has built-in crits, so. All right, fine. Uh, can we eat these three or two normals? Oh, we got the additional. Okay, we're fine. We're fine. If we get a super attack off, I am no longer worried. So that's good. Nice sick crit for zero, buddy. We love that. Nice. Well, that's fine. Again, he didn't kill us. He didn't. He didn't kill us. So guess what happens? We survive. That's that's what happens. Uh, I don't want to get the revive yet. So I kind of want to use Fat Boo's active skill here. I don't know. Is that smart? Would it be better to just get the revive? I mean, because like most certainly that's the super attack there in slot one. And because we entered the eight, like the turn with low HP, we can't survive it. He's got a million, but it, it's not going to be enough because uh, we're not guarding. We're not guarding. Let's grab these. Um, we'll grab those with Kid Boo. Again, we're just dead here. Uh, we are, we are in fact going to die. But, you know, let's see what happens. We could dodge it. We could five dodge it. Oh, he doesn't super. Okay. Uh, that's, that's good. That's good. I, I think this beast can only super in slot one. Maybe I'm making that up. Maybe I'm making that up. But I'm fairly certain this guy is locked to super against slot one for some reason. I think he has some weird rule that he can only super in slot one. Uh, maybe I'm, maybe I'm making that up. Maybe I'm misremembering. Maybe I'm thinking of the scripted beast Gohan in a different fight. But I, I'm like fairly certain this guy can only super in slot one. Yeah, let me know if I'm wrong because I, I need someone to correct me if I am. All right, sweet. 14 million. This should be a crit. Yeah, we do some nice damage there. Oh, we got an additional normal. That sucks. That, that would have been a really good super. All right, again, no super attack, no super. Yeah, I, I, I think this guy can only super in slot one. Uh, unless, of course, you, you have shenanigans with like a revive. Like if you have like a revive go off or um, like the giant skills, like that can make weird stuff happen. So, but barring that, all right, please don't lock them. All right, Buhan back in slot one, 1.28 million. That sucks, dude. Look how much defense we lose from that. He's at 1.47, and now he's only at like 1.2. Oh, that sucks. Okay, and we also lose a ton on key. Look how much key we lose. Look at that. Well, actually, it's not that much. Huh. Well, oh, whatever. Let's grab that. Um, let's grab... Oh, we can't get an 18 key with them, can we? I am slightly nervous. I kind of want to use this. Because I don't know if we're going to be able to use it for the rest of the fight if I don't use it here. So I am going to go ahead and use this. Uh, let me grab just like this. It doesn't, it doesn't matter. Um, and then we'll, we'll pop the active skill here. Again, I'm not going to play it. We're too deep in. I, I just want to get out of here. I want to get out of this fight, man. All right. That's good. Let's grab these. Very good. All right. So we're back up to full HP again. We still haven't used our revive, which is good. We have not revived yet. So we still have that going for us. Um, Buhan is still doing a ton of damage. I don't know, how is the attack... I assume the attack break's not going to carry over on the next turn, is it? I don't know how that works. Like, if you... I, I assume it just, like, disappears at the end of this turn. Like, if you don't use it, then it just goes away. That would be interesting to know, though, if it, like, does break it. We'll see. I don't know. Alright, sweet. Got some decent damage in there. Um, Bobby and Deborah, unfortunately, are ruining my plans. Of course, dude. Locking bosses are just so annoying. Locking's got to be the most toxic ability that you can do as a boss because it just, it screws up everything. It, it does. It's like, it, not being able to control your rotations doesn't seem like that big of a deal, but it is. I promise. It's, it's actually just catastrophic. Because, <sighs> like, not, like, not only do we lose Fat Boo off rotation, it's like we lose his revive. It's, oh, and I just felt compelled to pop his active skill as well. We're just not doing any damage either. Okay. Um, I have to throw Fat Boo in slot one right here. No links, but... I mean, he's at a million defense. Uh, let's grab these. We can't get any orbs with this guy. That's okay. We should be fine. Let's grab that. Uh, worst case scenario, we, we revive here with Fat Boo. All right, that's good. And here comes the super. I don't think this will kill us. I don't think. Will it? Surely not. Oh, super close. That's actually probably bad. 
How much damage is STR Fat Boo gonna take? We have support here. That's good. Uh huh. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me, man? Don't play Ultimate Battle. Okay. I'm gonna... I wanna go to bed. I wanna go to bed. Two orbs. Two orbs. We had a whole field of STR orbs just locked away. Just locked away on the complete other side that we couldn't get to. Fat Boo just had to take 550k from a super attack. I should have used the active skill, I guess. I guess I should have ghost ushered, but I, I thought that he would just die to the super attack. But we had too much defense. Uh... Why? Why are there no good villains? We're locked to one team, and it's the slowest team. Like, there is not another villain team that I could run in here. I'm going to try something. How many attempts do I have here? I'm probably going to cut and come. Yeah, we have three attempts. Okay, I'm going to cut. I'm going to come back at Beast. I'm going to try a different team build. It's going to be like Broly's team, but I'm going to bring a transformation boost unit. Just to... You guys, we'll be back in just a second. Ugh. Whew, okay, so we just made it through phase two, and uh, uh, let's let's go over my team here. Hopefully we don't get a really bad lock. You guys are already looking at this going, what the hell? Oh, no, dude, no, you didn't. You didn't do that. Uh, ah. Okay, well, he locked Harutagarn, but let's look at the team. All right, so this is what we've got here. We've got Harutagarn. Actually, let's stop at the top. So we got Broly as our leader, right? Broly is satisfying. The conditions for this mission are beat, beat the stage with an extreme AGL, an extreme tech, an extreme int, extreme STR, and extreme physical character on your team. We have satisfied all five of those conditions. Uh, and we threw Beast Gohan on the team because he's on Broly's leader skill. So, boom, uh, Beast is here. I'm not going to use his active skill. We're just going to trust in Harutagarn. We're going to transform with him. All right, we're trusting Harutagarn here. Uh, maybe that's a fool. Maybe, maybe I'm a fool, uh, but I'm gonna trust him. Uh, you know, we're we're just gonna we're gonna trust him. He remember he has that dodge stacking. Uh, if you guys don't remember, uh, this this guy does for the turn. Chance of evading enemy attacks, including super attacks, plus 10% within the same turn with each attack evaded. That stacks with his 70% chance to dodge. I've got a full dodge build on him. We, we've got a uh, 32 dodge build on him. It's the highest you can get on him. So, uh, let's see what happens. Let's grab these. We're at full HP. I'm just getting the same type orbs to move us closer to the Dokkan attack. So, come on. Come on, Harutagarn. Come on, buddy. Come through.
Oh, the cord went out. <laughs> so did I. Oh. Uh, I don't know if we would have survived that. I I don't want to know. I know what I need to know, right? That's I I know what I need to know, and that's that we dodged it. <laughs> ah! I don't know that Vegeta would have been much better in slot one right there, but I could have at least like transformed him or something. He's got like a little bit of extra damage reduction, and he just had like a higher stat, so I was like. Really like to get Vegeta in slot one right there. Broly, Chi, Lion, Limo, of course, going to get seven orbs. But at least we got some attack support from them. I probably could have transformed with Vegeta, but I, I'm being a little greedy here, getting a few more stacks in. Or I guess one more stack in. All right, all right, all right, all right. Um, next rotation, we have Beast. I will not be so much of a fool as to trust Harutagarn again. Uh, he should be on next rotation as well, I believe. Uh, it's either Harutagarn or Kid Buu. I'm not sure. Um, Kid Buu, actually. Uh, fun fact, Kid Buu. 70% chance for Kid Buu to... Uh, uh, sorry. 70% chance for Kid Buu to nullify this guy's super attack, by the way. I want, I want to gamble. I want to gamble. Surely Harutagarn, two, two runs in a row. Surely he wouldn't, right? Right? He wouldn't. He wouldn't. Would he? He might. What would you guys do here? I need to save Broly's active skill. Harutagarn is going in slot 1 on this rotation. That is not the question. The question is, do I use Beast's active skill? Let me go ahead and transform Harutagarn. This is never a question. What I'm doing with Harutagarn, that's, that's not the question. Here's the thing. Harutagarn has a 70% chance to dodge. He's got a 32% chance to dodge after that. If he eats one attack, we're dead. If I use Beast Gohan's active skill, though, we lose out on his damage for the turn. But I think I have to. I I, I don't know that I have a choice. I think I think I have to use the active because I don't trust him. I don't. I I wish I did, but I don't. I, I can't trust him. I can't trust him. I can't. I can't trust him. I can't. I can't do it, man. I, I, I would love to. That's that's some really good healing. Plus, we needed that as well. <sighs> man, dude. That's, that, that really sucks. Okay, well, maybe I should have gotten an 8. No, it doesn't matter because all the attacks are going to Gohan. All right, that's good. Okay, that's good. Okay. I mean, but still, um, Harutagarn could have died to any of those, right, right? If any single one of those normals hit us, we would have died. So, I'll take it. Uh, well... Hang on, we're not out of the woods yet. I I was going to say we're at least still going to get the attacks from Beast. But, okay, now. Now we're good. We're still going to get the Beast going active. Okay. Okay, okay. This is good. I, I did not want to lose all this damage from Beast. If you guys don't know, the uh, the enemy Beast Gohan has a 100% chance to stun you. So if you pop the Beast Gohan active skill and you get stunned, I mean, you just you lose out on all this damage. It's like, yeah, you don't get hurt, but you also don't do damage to the enemy. And this is definitely a fight where he can just start to stall you out. He can get really toxic with his locking. And if you're just not doing enough damage, I mean, you're just going to die. I mean, that's just the way it is, right? Like, if you're just not pounding this guy away, I mean, that's that's going to be it. Luckily, next turn, we are going to have Broly's Domain and we're going to have the Vegeta active skill. Because um, what's his name here? Beast Gohan's below 50% HP. So we're going to be able to immediately transform with Vegeta and then immediately pop the active skill. And I need to charge my phone. Thank you, notification. You may go away. Thank you. Appreciate that. Charge my phone. 15% battery. Yeah, charge my soul. How about that? My my internal, like, man. My, like, the, the little spirit that keeps me alive inside. He's, he's running out of steam here. I, I just want to beat this mission and go home. 
Please. Karudagarn's really putting me on like a 20 minute derailment here. You would, you rat bastard. Alright, hang on. Uh, I'm not gonna play Broly's. I'm not gonna play Broly's. I will be playing Vegeta's though. So, strap in for that. Okay, here's the deal, right? Beast go hunt or beast right here can only super attack in slot one. Kid Boo, Kid Boo, right here. Great chance of nullifying unarmed super attacks directed at this character. You guys don't know this Beast Gohan right here? Guess what kind of super attack he does. Um, give you three guesses really quickly here. I, I promise I'm not trying to draw out the wrong time of this video. Um, I'm just... I'm just... Uh, this is going to be the end of the video. Alright. We've established that I can win with this team. Alright. I, I feel like we've established that. This team, this team can beat it. It takes... I... Our phone died. My phone died. My phone is dead. <laughs> okay, um, we're back. Now, here's the thing. If we get super attacked and we don't nullify it, we die. Let's just, uh, we're gonna stop messing around here. Let's grab the orbs. We gotta nullify the super attack. We either not need to be super attacked or we need to nullify it. 70% chance if there is a super. 70% chance, 70% chance. God damn! 70! Goodbye.